Hey, what's up, guys? This is gonna be an opening. Sorry about the camera shaking. Uh, this is gonna be an opening of a pistol that I received today. It's gonna be the M45A1, but it's gonna be in black because sadly the tan version it was out of stock. So I ordered the black one, and you can see I set up a Marine Corps uniform in the background because it's M45 it is a Marine Corps pistol. Now, my friend have received exactly the same pistol, but in tan. Sadly, his one broke, unfortunately. After his first airsoft game, he was messing with it and he broke something with it. So, he... The idea of this video was that we both were supposed to show our pistols. Sadly, he's not able to do that because he had to ship it back. But he's gonna receive a brand new one very, very soon. So. If he managed to get that one before I edit this video, you will guys see at the end of this video his pistol. But if he doesn't, you're just gonna see my one. Alright, end with the chat. Let's go with the video. Alright, starting off with my knife. There we go. Just like this. It's very hard to do with one hand, but I will manage somehow. Okay, there's the unnecessary sheet right here with all the information and here is the box, obviously they had to fill it up with something. Also the, yeah, there's the pistol, The that's it for the box, I'll show that at the side, here's the pistol. Uh, obviously I ordered the M45A1. As you can see, it's the gas blowback type in black from WE. It's a, a experiment, you could say. I have a pistol from Tokyo Marui. It's the M9. You guys can see it right now. That's my M9. It's from Tokyo Marui. You can see right here. And I'm just gonna show. Yeah, there you go. It's heavily used. I have it since 2015. But uh, yeah, it still works. Now, this one is the WE. Focus. This one's from WE, so I'm gonna try out this one now. Now, opening the box. First thing we get is the menu, you could say, the catalog with the M1911 on it. And we get the pistol and a mag. Now, let's start with the mag. Mag is made out of metal with a. Is this metal? I think it is with the metal bottom right here it's for green gas uh, you guys can see it right here it's a spring mag for green gas here is where you load it and here is the pistol I don't think there anything else comes in with the, nope nothing all right move the box out of the way all right we're gonna take out the pistol from the bag Somehow I'm managing it to do it with one hand. Strangely. Here's the pistol. Oh my god. It's very greasy. You can see from here, it's very greasy. Here's a Thai made in Taiwan sticker. So not made in China. Here's the uh, beaver tail uh, safety grip. Uh, oh yeah. If you don't press this, you can't pull the trigger. I don't really know what to say about this pistol at the moment because I believe that many of you already know M45s I mean 1911 so this is basically like another M1911 but it's the Marine Corps version with the rail on the bottom and just different grips and better tanks I guess uh, looks better than the tan one at least for me personally I'm uh, gonna cock it it's going to be very difficult to do with one hand. There we go. Uh, here you can see the barrel inside. Come on, camera focus. There we go. You could see the inside. Here's the barrel. That's how you throw the slide. Aim, shoot, basically. 
You can also cock it with your thumb. Uh, here you have a uh, aiming sight. They have white dots on it so you could see them much better. And yeah, the pistol's made out of metal. And with the polymer or plastic grips. So not bad. It it was very cheap. It was like 120 euro, I believe so. So it's a very cheap gun you can get yourself. This is just basically a got it for the experiment. Um surprisingly it's made of metal. So it's 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 pretty good. For a pistol that was so cheap, it's made of metal. So either it breaks <laughs> or it will live on. I didn't receive a screw part to screw on a suppressor. I seen few people got those. I haven't received it. Um yeah, now I will show you guys the disassembled version of this. Alright guys, here you can see Somer disassembled pistol. It's not fully, like the barrel's still inside and stuff like that. But I didn't really want to disassemble it fully. Um yeah, I took off the spring because it was very annoying with the spring. Spring's actually pretty decently managed, like it's fully oiled. Same with the whole pistol, it's like super oiled as you guys can see right here it's very oily in there same with the bottom slide it's you can see all the oil all over it uh, to disassemble is actually pretty easy all you have to do is just pull the slide halfway just like on any other M1911 and you pull out this pin and the slide comes off it's a bit different to M9 M9 is much more simpler and less things are moving around but yeah that's basically the dissembled pistol and that's basically it for the video thank you for watching and i hope you come see me in the next video bye bye